great. Everton is fifth with four wins, one draw, one loss this season. A not lot bad, of eh? things to yeah, not bad. A lot of things to talk about. We have an <laughs> Everton fan here, Kamal, and thank you for coming. Thank you for having me. Yeah, we got me. a lot. I, I'm going to go straight <laughs> okay, into, sure. in, into it. You know, sure, sure, sure. For, sure, for sure, example, sure, sure. Benitez. Benitez. Um, What's your thoughts? We have a nickname for him. Yeah, back when he was a. Uh, was a bitter rival of us. The, we call him the um, fat Spanish waiter. What? Why? Because fat he, he, he Spanish looked, waiter. Yeah, that's what we used to call him. Uh huh. Uh, because he looks like a fat Spanish waiter. Uh, uh, mix, mix, mix views at this point of time, because at at one point I want to give him the benefit of the doubt, because he is Rafa Benitez. He is accomplished in his own ways. But is as an ex Liverpool manager, does it play a part? That is that is where the the conflict happens. So that's where I'm I'm conflicted, like I said, to be honest. Because he's a red. You know, and, and it's it's almost like I said, uh, what if what if Potichino went to Spurs? Yeah. What would you feel? I, I would wouldn't like want it. Yeah, exactly, right. But he didn't win anything. Eh? <laughs> so that's maybe a different story. Maybe that's <laughs> Yeah. But I mean Rafa Benitez have a lot to prove to I mean, for me personally, I think he has a lot to prove. I think that he need, he needs to show that he is beyond colours. He is colour blind. Beyond colours? Colorblind. Okay. And the, the 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 badge is worth more than you know, what's going on. Yeah. Do you think he will? Um. Right now, everything seems to be going a certain direction. Um. He is now. Now is we are not doing very well. Personally, I don't think we're doing very well right now because of injuries and whatnot. But uh, we can see he's trying lah. Hmm. Yeah, hmm. I think from when, when the way he behaved on the touchline, I can see that he's trying. Well, well, you guys are fifth, and hmm. but uh, unlike Arsenal, hmm. you guys had a kind or kind of an easy run uh, hmm. to say because you guys beat Brighton. Okay. You guys beat Burnley. Yes. Uh, but you lost to Ev- uh, Aston Villa. Yes. Uh, and Aston Villa beat Manchester United, right? <laughs> so they are not quite a easy no, yeah. easy team, and you hmm. all drew with Leeds. Hmm. So this upcoming weekend. Uh, against Manchester United away at at Old Trafford, right? Is considered your big test. This yeah for ba- Rafa, for Rafa, but I think okay for Rafa, it's nothing new because like I said, he was a he was a red, hmm. right? So Liverpool and Manchester United always had this rivalry. So ah. going to Manchester United has always been personally, I feel has always been something strong for him, hmm. right? Now coming over to Manchester United, uh, coming over to Liv- uh, Everton, and knowing that this his big test is against Manchester United. He has a lot to prove, but that said, if he continues to play the formation that he keeps on playing right now, I, I don't think we can win. Why? Why? Why do you? He's say playing so? too much of a defensive role right now. He's playing too too deep and allowing people to attack us, relying on speed from Townsend and 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 what's his name? Townsend Gray. and Gray. Okay, but he's forgetting. There's no one there to link these two from the defense. Right, Dakor and the uh, Kore, the Kore and and Alan, good players. No, no, they are, they are, they stop the, the team the other team from playing. That's what they're supposed to be doing, right? Mm. They are they are really defensive. They do their job, but they're not there to help connect the front. Yeah, right. Okay. So we need someone in the middle of the park, just in front of of. Uh, to me, I feel in front of the Kore and Alan. To link with Townsend and Gray, uh, uh, attacking center, something mid. like center, yeah, yes. attacking midfielder. Yeah. Then that with with this guy in the middle, then we have a huge chance of actually demolishing Manchester United. But do you guys have such a player? <sighs> or you be had, Rodriguez? We <laughs> <laughs> we had lah, like, like we had, we had, like, we had, had such a player. Yeah. Um, apparently, he moved to Arabic pastures. Um, Gomez is there. Okay, Andre Gomez is there, but he's like, there's no confidence. Like, he's not playing with confidence, enough confidence, I think. Yeah. Uh, oh, but the good news is last last game, um, the, the when 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 the Corey scored, he brought in this player called Dobbins. Okay. Dobbins, I can't remember his first name. Dobbins made a change. You see, the moment that Dobbins came in, he brought in Dobbins. He brought in Gordon, which are attacking players, and immediately the Corey scores. So immediately the link was there, and. And if if Dobbins and 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 or uh, Gordon can stand up, can step up to the plate, yes, there's a chance. Nice. Well, he's a young player. In in Carabao Cup, uh, West Ham has won Manchester <laughs> United, yes. and Aston Villa has recently last week yep. won Manchester United. Yep, and yep. and from what I hear from Manchester United fans, uh-huh. that 
uh, Manchester United is not been playing really really well. So it seems that you guys do have a chance, even we if do. you are playing defensively. I don't know. We, we I mean, the ball, the ball. My mom used to say, "Bola tu bulat," huh. right? The ball can go anywhere. Yeah, the ball right? is round. The, the ball, ball can go anywhere. Exactly. Mm. So there's there's a chance that there's a chance for any of the, any any team to win, right? Uh, But you want that CAM and you want a more attacking approach yes. from. Benitez. I want to. I want more bet, better playing. More, like, like more creative flow when it comes to attacking. We I think solidly we are good defensive. Okay, the first really? quite solid. Yeah. I think, I think so. Um, yeah, I think so. I, I like the Corey and Ellen though. Yeah, they are like the wall in front of the defensive. Correct, wall. correct, correct. And yeah. and these they, they they play a part. They play what they're supposed to be doing. Yeah. But again, need that spark. We need a uh, a uh, uh, Arteta, uh, Arteta, mm. uh, uh, Steven Pina. Uh, 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 what is what is it called? Uh, Fellaini and someone just in the middle yeah, to yeah. link. Yeah, everybody. Fellaini, Manchester United fans may <laughs> not agree with you. Well, uh, maybe Alteta. Uh, for those of you who do not know, or maybe not old enough like us, uh, Alteta did play for Everton. He was. He was the creative midfielder he before was. he moved to Arsenal. Uh, we call him the little Spanet. Mm. Yep. He so was, you, was good. How, how's your opinion of him now managing uh, Arsenal? Um, he's young. I mean, uh, compared to being a, a, a manager, he's young. He's a very young manager. He needs to learn. He needs. He needs to go through the ropes first. Yeah. Mm. But he just his previous job was assistant to Pep, yeah. right? Yeah. And now all of a sudden he's a head coach. Yeah. Suddenly so he's in charge of everything. Exactly. Right? So yeah. he's young. He needs to learn more. Mm. Not that he's not capable. I'm not saying he's not capable. Okay. Mm. That's. I did not say that. Yeah. He. I think in in a few years time mm. he he can make a team go strong. Nice. Yeah. I think so too. Yeah. Oh, that's that's maybe good. not Arsenal lah, but somebody else. Hey, <laughs> well, he he is signing young players, you know. So <laughs> exactly. he should be there for at least the next uh, four years. At uh, least I don't know. Your board might not think so. Ah, I'm not sure. <laughs> uh, Arsenal is not like Chelsea. No, <laughs> uh, we don't uh, just fire uh, managers every two or three seasons. Really? Yeah, we don't have the money. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So so what about Richard Lisson? Is he a striker or is he a attacking midfielder? Can he be that more? He, I mean, okay, relax, Richie. Richie is. Which is temperamental. I would say. You think? I f- I feel that he's temperamental. He's a good player, no yeah. doubt. Mm. No doubt, he's a good player. Mm. But he's temperamental. When when he clicks, he really clicks. You know, mm. when he clicks whatever yeah. everything he does like works. Yeah. Yeah. But when he's like not feeling it, he can't even pass simple balls. Like he's always falling down. So Ricky. Oh, so he blows hot and cold. Yeah, to me that's why I feel Ricky. Yes, he's a good player. No doubt. That's why PSG wanted him. Mm. Right, at one point PSG wanted him because he is a good player, mm. but he I, and I, but and to put him in that central midfield role, the attacking midfield role, I think he lacks the maturity ah. because he wants to attack. Okay, put him in the wings, he'll strive. Ah, put him in the middle, like in the striker mode, yeah. maybe he, maybe he'll do well. Yeah, but to put him in the middle to spray passes, he may not have that calmness. Yeah, not yet. Or not maturity, yet. like yeah. you say, lah. No, uh. I don't think so. He can. I don't think he's the right player for that role. Mm. Uh, maybe Townsend, if if, if you really want to try it. Townsend goes to the middle, uh, Gray and Richie the, the flanks that could work as well. Okay, so hashtag Benitez, please uh, maybe <laughs> try try that out. Yeah, maybe <laughs> maybe hey, who knows? Yeah. Okay, so Rodriguez. Wow. The, the if you want to rewind the story, right? The dramatic, the drama started <laughs> when you know Everton fans were very happy. When Ancelotti Definitely. came in and took over Everton, oh and God. nobody expected that. That was great. Nobody expected. No awesome. disrespect to Everton. No, no, no. But no. Ancelotti just came in. But as dramatic as he coming in, <laughs> it was also dramatic of him leaving just like that after in after one season. How much can I curse in the show? Huh? huh? How much can I curse? Ah, uh, the, the bleeps are uh, <laughs> you know in in finite. <laughs> let's let's do, do do that. You know. <laughs> um, What's your thoughts, man? I, okay, honestly, I think it's an <laughs> decision of him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you come in, and we we uh, the whole the whole of Merseyside Blue is on you. You know, like they they practically make call him Don Carlo. You know, he was yeah, like, yeah. revered. You know, everywhere yes. he goes, he was people were singing songs of him. Even when he was in his car, people see him. People did like driving. When he was driving, they were singing songs of him, praising him so much. And the fact that he left just like that, I'm guessing it's because of, because of money. Okay, uh, it just sucks, lah. But why come to Everton in the first place if it's about money? I don't know. 
don't know. I mean, I I don't know what he was thinking when he 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 joined everything. So there was no like statement. There was a statement. There was he just he, he was packed really his bag. The usual bureaucrat and left. You know, the usual bureaucrat statement. I'm here because this, I want to make this club prosper. Blah 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 blah. Then you know? after that, that's when when he yeah, came in. Yeah. When he left, he says, "Uh, it's time for me to move on." Blah, 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 blah. What? It's the usual bull, bull. It's one season. Exactly. Exactly. And and I think there's so much more that he could have done if he stayed. Uh, maybe it's the board. Maybe he didn't like the board. Maybe maybe it's money. Maybe I don't know. I just I just think there's an of a move him. Unfortunately, the the consequences is Rodriguez. Yes, right. He came in because Ancelotti because came Ancelotti. to Everton. He made it clear. He made it clear. He made right? it clear. Yeah. If he followed his uh, mentor, or his Correct. manager yep. over, then once Ancelotti left, he left quietly actually. Yeah. Because actually I didn't know, okay? Oh, you didn't know? Uh, I didn't know, okay? I was <laughs> recent, just to prepare for this show. Right. I'm looking at the uh, EPL app and uh-huh. I'm looking at Everton squad just to get to know uh, Everton's players okay. besides Gray, Townsend, uh, right. Corey and Ellen and all that. That one I know. So I just wanted to know more. Uh-huh. When I look at the squad list, there was no Rodriguez. No Rodriguez. And I was like quite surprised <laughs> and there was no news about him even leaving, right? Oh, I think like three, four days ago, I think. Huh. It just happened. It just happened three, four days ago, I think. Oh, is it? So yeah. can you just update uh, us? Well, he he's in Qatar right now. He's having fun with the Dubai uh, with the Qatarians money. <laughs> uh yes, big money. I, I, again, I think it's big money. Big money transfer. I'm sure he's him, disappointed. Huh? I don't know. I don't or know. what? You know? Or doesn't he doesn't feel for the club at all? Or uh, or what? Are you as fans think? I mean, I, so many questions, right? Again, again, as fans, I, I, as a, as a fan, I think it's it's an of a move again for him because he's just been there for one season and he left because Ancelotti is not there but but this is it just proved that that, that the footballer's contract now this right it is as, it is it is as as useful as banana notes yeah world you know, war 2 right? uh, banana exactly notes, banana notes yeah. yeah you can use it for anything it doesn't mean anything it doesn't mean anything anybody can just buy off your contract just like that you can work for one season and then next season you can go to someone else yeah. So the, the just throw money. It, yeah. It, the no number of years that you can commit in the contract, just leave it blank. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, just leave it blank. Exactly, because yeah. there's no, and there's no, I think I think ethics plays a part here, yeah. right? right? No? Responsibility. Responsibility. Not like uh, not like Wayne Rooney, yeah. Uh? No, no, uh, no, no. Wayne really. Rooney sticking to the B so far. <laughs> yeah. Even though don't not know when when he come in, I don't think he knows what's going on. <laughs> Wayne Rooney was in and it was is a sad case well. Yeah, you cannot he, scam lah. He wanted to stay to be honest. Mm. When when after he after Manchester United he went back to Everton he wanted to stay, but they didn't want him. Who the board didn't the, want him? The board didn't want the him. Board didn't want him. Ah. I think we just wise or something. I don't know. I don't know what exactly is the reason. Yeah. Uh, the board didn't want him. That's why he left for US. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. Rooney is an Everton Rooney boy. Everton. Yeah, yeah. He he claimed it after he after he left Manchester United he said he was sleeping in Everton jersey. Right. So and he so really he, wanted he to come wanted, back. He wanted come to come back, come back home. Back. Yeah, but unfortunately. We uh, the board didn't know how to use him. Who was the manager at that point? Uh, Big Sam. Huh. Sam Allardyce. Sam Allardyce. Yeah, Sam Allardyce was was the manager at that point. Strange decision. Would you have? I would have kept him. I mean, regardless, he's he's Wayne Rooney. He's class. Hmm. Right. You put but him he anywhere. has some drinking issues and he likes to go out and drink. He's not C Ronaldo who. Keeps no, 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 fit, no, no, right? no, of course not, of course not. Yeah, but, no, but you still think that he has some. He's class, yeah, exactly. Yeah. You don't have to play him every game. Yeah, but you keep him there. You keep him for the youth, mm. you know, mentorship, whatever, you know. Mm. Um, it'd be a good, uh, growing system for for the youth. You know, just to have Wayne Rooney there. Come on, mm-hmm. Wayne Rooney. He's the guy who's who. Like, if you remember that, he played for what? Uh, what was the team he played for? For in the US or in the US? In the US. Oh, that's true. Yeah, there was this one game where he 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 ran back. He ran back, yeah. He ran back all the way back and cross, and that guy scored a goal. It's like, how? How? Yeah. Wayne Rooney, you know? Yes, that's Wayne Rooney. Yeah, so <laughs> it's so it's stupid for them to let him go, lah. So for Benitez, he's uh, so Rodriguez. Your thoughts is okay. He's the same level as Angelotti. Yeah, a hole. Yeah, he's, he's, he's an ass. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah. What I mean, What about the play? Oh, okay. I mean, you could still stay. You could still play, right? I mean. To and maybe maybe there's other reasons behind it. You maybe there was some a, uh, rumors, is it? Or yeah, you know? some 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 things going on, saying that he and 
Benitez didn't get along when they were in Real Madrid. I don't know how true this is. And maybe that could be the reason why he also he left Everton. Because Benitez came in. Because Benitez came in. Mm. Um, maybe, I don't know. Now, look, if you're uh, a professional footballer, you try to make it work. Exactly, right? right. Mm. You, you try to make it work. The amount of money they pay you, you should really try to make it work. Yeah. But we don't, again, we, don't know, tantrum. we don't know who is doing the tantrum here. Oh yeah, could be Benitez, could be him. Correct, correct. Could be Benitez yeah. didn't like him so much and let him play, yeah. or, or he didn't like Benitez so much he doesn't want to play. Yeah. So we don't know. We. The but Benitez person, is maybe not like your other manager who went to uh, Barcelona, I think. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> that oh, one, the wow. famous case, the famous case of the uh, Umanias. <laughs> oh wow! Well, if you compare what. Well, <laughs> This is bad managers along the way. This <laughs> but this is a quality manager. Yeah, know? it's a quality manager. Right. Right? It's just that they say Ronald? player management. Yeah, yeah, Ronald Koeman is is a is a quality manager. Ancelotti is a quality manager. Um, who was before him? Uh, Mauro Silva, right? Silva. Uh, okay, not sure. Maybe no Silva, not so much. <laughs> but but these two are quality managers, and 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 the fact that they did this to Everton, it's like. More yes. Oh yes, yeah, Moyes, Moyes also, uh, he should have stayed. Lah. You all love him, huh? I, I, I do, I do. I mean, I personally, because I, I think, I think if he, if he had stayed, everything could have been bigger now, right? Because he's been building the team from scratch, mm. just like what Ferguson did with Manchester United. Oh, I remember that time was, Os- there's one player, Osman. Osman, Leon Osman, yeah. Oh man. I love him. Leon Osman. <laughs> I, I, I as an Arsenal fan, I have no yeah. problem with Everton. I really like how Everton right, plays right, and right, he's right, one right. of the players that, one of the midfielders that yeah, I really yeah. like watching them play. Leon Osman is underrated to be honest. He is. He is very underrated. Yeah, he is one of, he is one of the hardest workers. He is, um, he's, he's always there and you can always count on him, Leon Osman. But there are people who are more, still the limelight more, I guess. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So going back to Moyes. Uh-huh. So him leaving was a bad decision for him. What, what do you think for of, him? of his fate right now? Like he went to Manchester United, then after that, didn't do a, didn't so do well. Anything. Then now he's <laughs> doing quite well with West Ham. Or, West Ham. What, what do you think after as a, Villarreal, right? Yeah. Um. At one point, I think it's he. I, I think he he needs to learn this. You know what I mean? Learn. Oh, he need to it's learn a journey, this. is it? Yeah, it's, it becomes a journey. journey for him. That's why he's doing, maybe that's why he's doing so well at at ah. because he's learning from whatever mistake that he's been doing before, and maybe that's why Wesem is doing so well as well. Mm. Yeah, maybe I don't know. But the Mark Noble issue, I don't know. It was not very clever, lah. <laughs> <laughs> on on paper, it made sense, <laughs> but maybe but you know. The as ball, my mom said, "Bola to bulat, the ball is round." <laughs> Who are your legendary players? You feel? Legendary for everything. Yeah, since you you wow. supported and all that, um, since you knew the club, everybody knows Dixie Dean. Dixie oh. Dean is the best. Is one of the greatest players in England in English football. Okay, Dixie Dean. Then we have Gary Lineker. Gary Lineker played for there. Um, Gary Lineker played for Everton. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think so. He did. Yeah. 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 Am I wrong? Uh, no, I'm. I'm. I'm, <laughs> no, I'm amazed no. because I. Uh, no, I need, you know more. Or you know the. Uh, yeah, I think Gary, Gary Lineker did play for Everton. Yeah. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, okay? Uh, um, Gascoigne. Yeah. Paul Gascoigne. Um, also he didn't do much. He also is a legend. I think he's a legend. Uh, David Onsworth. Love him. Um, uh, Duncan Ferguson. Oh man. Big Dunk. Yeah. How can I forget Big Dunk, right? Big Dunk and Duncan Ferguson. He did take over for a bit. A bit. Yeah, he was doing okay for a bit. Yes, Duncan Ferguson. He's, he's now uh, with the youth, is it? He's in, still in the squad. He's yeah. still in the squad, yeah. We see him in the dugout. Yeah, right? he's always there. He's always there. Uh, what's his name? Neville Southall. Mm-hmm. Tim Howard. Yeah. Um, Leon, Leon Osman. Leighton Baines. So, a lot of uh, football fans, right? Uh, they don't quite like this person, you know? Who is this? And they think that he's lousy. Who is and this? And they think that uh, he doesn't fit to be in the national team. Oh, okay. Uh, who, do, who do you think? Uh? An Everton player who fits that bill. Right now? Yeah. Ross Barkley? Mm, for us, he's more like Pickford. Pickford? Uh-huh. Jordan Pickford? Jordan Pickford. Uh, we feel that uh, there are better keepers than Pickford for the national England national who? team. Uh I'm not sure. Exactly. I mean, it's just so, that we felt so that... So people can feel uh, there are better keepers out there. But right now, who? Uh, Anderson. I'm an Arsenal player, so uh, I can say Ramsdale. But 
Uh, really? It's only a few games, so I, yeah. I, I wouldn't say I wouldn't Ramsey, say that Ramsey much. Ramsey is still very very uh, new. I'm not uh, okay. I'm not too sure about other England keepers, but Pickford doesn't have the skills like from playing from the back. He just likes to clear it. Okay. What what people say, Tonjo lah. Yeah, yeah, okay, right. Yeah. yeah, that's one. Uh, he's okay. a good uh, reflex save uh-huh, uh-huh. uh, goalkeeper, but that's what he is, right? And of course, famously injuring VVD. Uh, that, that, that was VVD's fault. Oh, that's me being his fault. Yeah, yeah. You could see what he was doing. He was one who went. Who was the one who attacked Pickford? Ha- Pickford was the one going for the ball. Ah. If you if you rewind, if we can get the clip, rewind it again. Yeah. You can actually see uh, VVD when going for Pickford. Ah. And Pickford was just there. Blah blah blah. He was the one who got it. Ah. Yeah. VVD was the one who got hurt instead. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Nice perspective. <laughs> uh. So so it's VVD's fault. I was blaming. <laughs> <laughs> So so, how do you rate uh, Pickford as your number one? Ah, oh, wow. Jordan Pickford, hi. Mm. To say that, um, uh, see, I'm conflicted as well right now because Why? I I feel I uh, he does deserve to be in the England squad. Okay. Okay, because England does not play that much games. Okay. Okay, he is a good he is a good goalkeeper. Yeah. He is good, but for him to be playing week in week out. No. For Everton, for Everton, I think we need someone better. I feel, I seriously feel that we need someone better for for goalkeeper. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm not doubting his abilities. I'm just saying that at that level, yeah, there is someone. Yeah, I, I mean, I'm you can pretty get sure someone there's someone better. better like, like, um, if we can get people like uh, Ter Stegen, Makan mm-hmm. Ter Stegen, mm-hmm. or or who's this? Uh, I can't remember names right now, mm-hmm. uh, but yeah, if we get Mark Andrew to stay in the wicket, right? Nice. He's not playing. He's he's on the bench, isn't he? I'm not sure. So he's, Mark Andrew to stay in is playing for Barcelona right now, mm-hmm. but he's on the bench. I you think, think you think those, that's the player that you? Yeah, want? yeah. I think we can get Mark Andrew to stay in. That's great, man. Okay, so you need a goalkeeper. You need Definitely. a CM. Yeah. Anyone else? Someone to part partner Kevin Lewin? No. What no. other no, 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 gaps no, no. that you feel that uh, next transfer Lewin, window? Uh, Kevin Lewin needs to stay healthy. <laughs> that's what he needs to do. But he doesn't get injured. He's out right now because of injury. Oh, yeah, that's uh, why Rondon is playing. Broken toe, eh? Broken toe. <laughs> Doing training, is it? <laughs> oh, what? What happened? It's a broken toe. I don't know. Don't know. La. <laughs> I don't know what happened, but he got. I think yeah, he got hurt. The the. Uh, yeah, just, just stay healthy, lah. Please. He's good, man. He is. He's he is, good he is. in his header. He's he he's was strong. Again, underrated player. Underrated player. Has he, he been with Everton? He has been everything from from youth, wow. yeah. Okay. The, the fact that he went to England during the yeah. the World Cup, right? Yeah. He went with England. Is it World Cup or Euro Cup? What was the last one? Uh, Euro. Euro Cup, right? Yes. And he didn't he didn't play a game. Yeah. That's just stupid, right? Mm. I mean, he, he. I mean, just to get selected, I think it's quite good progress for him. Though. True, but at least give him a game, a half a half an hour, like you know, like ten minutes. Just get, yeah, get a feel, he right? might do better than Harry Kane, you know. Harry Kane didn't score, did he? Yeah, the first few games he yeah. didn't score. <laughs> Harry Kane is. And and ah, uh, yeah. I think that Kevin Lewin will be a uh, uh, will be a force in nature. Right and now. he looks as if he's under the tutelage of yeah. uh, Duncan, Duncan Ferguson. Ferguson. Yeah, exactly. the way he jumps for the yep, headers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The headers and everything. Yeah, <laughs> the yeah, style yeah, of play, exactly, the movement, right? Exactly. It's exactly like Duncan and, Ferguson. And he knows where to find the little holes where most strikers cannot get to. Yeah. So yeah. if he's out, uh, there's Townsend then, right? No, Ron, Rondon. Rondon. We got Rondon. Okay. Rondon from. From China, so it's not good enough. Or <laughs> yeah. I mean, you of course everyone. I don't think so. I mean, okay. Rondon used to play for Newcastle. Okay, that's where he and Benitez met, I guess. Mm. Right. And then he went to China. Mm. There's a reason why he went to China, right? Mm. Right. Mm. There's a reason why because he cannot make uh, mm. honestly because he he's not Can't. confident enough, confident enough to be there. Yeah, yeah. Right. And then when you put him back, it's, it's I just don't have confidence in Rondon. Ah. Yeah. Do you know of a return date for Where? Uh, Kevin Lewin? No, not yet. Nothing yet. Mm. I, I, I don't catch up yet. Mm. Yeah, but yeah, Rondon. Come on, ah. I mean, I saw him when he was in. I mean, I, I, you know, when when he plays with, with Newcastle, right? Come on, ah. Just you just you just know this guy. Come on, ah. Who else? Who else? Who else? Ellis Sims. Let's give the young boys a chance, ah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. So, how, how what's your prediction, match prediction for this the, weekend's this game? This weekend. Yeah. 
United and and and, and Everton. Yeah. Um, I think we're gonna nick it one zero. One zero. Confident. Ah, uh, yeah, no. <laughs> but yeah, but the, heart, the heart says. The heart says, yeah, we're gonna nick it one zero. Yeah. Yeah. One zero, okay. hopefully. Nice. Uh, Digne, Digne is gonna score it. What is your expectation as a fan? Uh, for this season I mean uh, when at the end of the season what would you expect uh, what would make you satisfied what do I expect for the club yeah for the club yeah. Europa mm. you know if we, if we cannot we need to be fighting for Europa already we cannot just keep missing it by one or two slots and you think you, you can right this season I think every season we can do it oh, okay. every season with Ancelotti we miss it just by a bit with Mauro Silva also Silva is it no with Coleman also we miss it by a bit so we always missed it by that bit, you know, and 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 it's because of injuries. There's no there's no cover like so the depth, lah. The yeah, the and again, we have Calvin Lewin who's good, and then when he's out, we have Rondon. <laughs> <laughs> the voice, sorry, the okay. voice, the tone itself <laughs> tells the story. <laughs> Rondon, I have nothing against you. I just think that you're not you're not you're, so, you're not supposed to be there, man. <laughs> Seriously, Rondon, go play for somewhere else. Uh, go, go China or what? Uh. Yeah, go back to China. Yeah, go back to China. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean this in a good way. Yeah, yeah, they're, yeah. they're paying you a lot of money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and you right. can strive there, right? Yeah, Instead exactly. Of struggle. I wish that we'll be in top four, at least. A lot of people going for top four. Uh. Yeah. Arsenal also top four. Arsenal cannot. Uh. Cannot. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, I, also, I, I also agree. Arsenal not this season. Uh. <laughs> I also agree. Not this season. Yeah. Arsenal has as long as the both Spurs, huh? at least. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Arsenal has, has not, nothing so far, is it? L- last two seasons, uh, eight and eight. Ah, uh, okay, just stay mm. there. Yeah. Let's just stay there. Okay, la, let, let Everton shine. <laughs> yeah, Everton shine. <laughs> so, so finally, what, what are your kind of a shout out to, shout let's out. say, you know, we are, we are posting this on social media. What's your oh. shout out to maybe Everton fans and, yeah. To all Everton fans out there, okay, especially those in the Singapore Everton Supporters Club, have faith, okay. I know that Rafa Benitez may not be the manager that we want. I know that he still stinks of Merseyside Red, but I don't think he's doing that bad so far. Okay, he is trying. We can tell he's more energetic on the touchline. So have faith in him. 